today's tutorial guys I'm going to be teaching you how to guys you can use the dash place command let's get to how you're going to do it so what you guys are going to do is you guys are before you guys load in a world make sure you have a copy of this world in case you guys are enabling experiments but all you guys are going to do is you guys are simply just going to want to go ahead and you guys are going to want to make sure that you have command blocks enabled and you guys are going to also want to make sure that you have access to experiments so be targeting the data driven structure jigsaw structures command for the experiment section so now once you've done that we will go into your this world and then we will continue on with the tutorial or you can do the structure setting so we're going to start off with something really basic and this is the jigsaw block if you're on certain consoles or devices you guys will not be able to use this feature to its full functionality but this is also to do with these structures so if you want to place jigsaw uh, you can do you can do that place jigsaw and then you can do the various xyz coordinates that you guys have and you can count it by depth and stuff um, but i'm not going to do that just so you guys can save time and um, but that is a command but what we're going to focus on is the dash place and then we're going to do structure and then we're going to do minecraft ruins or minecraft child chamber um those are the current ones available so we can pick which one we want to do so let's go ahead and do that so all we're going to do here is we're going to do dash play structure minecraft and then we're going to type coordinates in of what we want so we are going to put in our coordinates of this here what you guys are doing is you're going to add the command true and then it should actually load in the place command so once you guys as you guys can see here it is loading in the actual build right here so as you can see it's loaded the building above here this build is huge guys so uh, make sure you have it in a really good space and uh, this is how you guys can actually easily load structures um pre-generated structures from your minecraft um like obviously survival experience into a creative map if you guys want to use these structures for whatever you may want um this is pretty cool you guys can get to experience some of, you can use some of the templates from these biomes um, these structures in your own world to add the pre-generated trees to your minecraft world you could do minecraft dash place feature minecraft uh like close color and then you guys are going to want to do cherry tree underscore tree and then underscore feature and then your coordinates of where you want to spawn the tree um once you guys have done this you guys can press it as you can see it will not work on this um on my specific platform i'm recording this on um but you can try this out if you guys have access to the experiment on your platform that you are on um as you click see your, as you saw at the start of the video I'm not too sure necessarily the specifics but this is a brand new command that i have seen be mentioned and is being covered um in an upcoming update um so yeah hopefully someone can let me know down in the comment section below what this dash place feature rule feature is fully entailing of um i would assume it's to do with everything other than trees and like structures um but yeah hopefully you guys did enjoy this let me know what you think down below like and subscribe if you guys are new and uh, let me know what you want to see next thanks for watching have an amazingly blessed day and i will see you next time Bye bye